Hey guys, today we're gonna learn how to import data from Access Database. Uh, you can import data from any external data sources like SQL Server, text, and from the web page or any other Oracle and stuff like that. Uh, today we're gonna just learn how to import it from Access Database. For that, uh, just click on Data tab, click on From Access, just browse to a place where you have your database saved. To select your access database and click on open. Now you have an option to import in the form of you can import a table or your SQL you know uh, queries save in the back end of your access database. For now I'm just gonna select um, select contract master click on OK. Now you have an option to import data into your table pivot report chart or you can just leave it as a connection. Uh, if you're using Excel 2013, uh, you have the advantage of adding this data into a data model, which you can further you know, link it into your other tables from other sources or within Excel. For now, let's just import it as a table uh, and click on OK. So you have a data there in front of you. Now, if you want to edit the connection properties, just click on data connections, and this is your connection. Just go to properties. You can change the name of your connection to a, a meaningful name. Now, make sure that um, you change the connection mode to read, unless you want to write from Excel itself. So if you want to save the connection file, for other purposes, you can use this function, export connection file. Uh, if you want to refresh every 60 minutes or other, you know, custom time, you can use this box. You can use this to uh, enable data refresh on file open. Uh, for now, just click on OK and close. So if you just want this for a time being or just a, for one time import, you can still convert this to a range and click on OK. That will make your uh, data, you know, basically unlink your table from the database. So I hope you find this useful. If you have any questions, please feel free to comment. Thank you.